Welcome to Recovery Meditations, Episode 3. Today's reflection is on the theme of the negative reaction of impatience, and how to shift your perspective and look at a situation calmly to avoid being impatient, and the consequences that follow. Begin by getting yourself comfortable in whatever way suits you. Feel rooted, safe and relaxed through this position. This guided meditation will help you reflect on how to be more patient through your day. Once you're settled, gently close your eyes. We've set aside a few minutes so you can practice relaxing. The more you practice, the more easily you will relax under pressure. Start by concentrating on your breathing. Breathe in and out. Deeply in and slowly out. In, out. Keep breathing slowly like this. You can slow your breathing even further by counting. Breathe in to the count of four, hold to the count of three, and breathe out to the count of five. Breathe in, two, three, four. Hold, two, three, exhale, two, three, four, five. Breathe in, two, three, four. Hold, two, three, exhale, two, three, four, five. Breathe in. Hold, exhale, keep breathing, letting your breath go slowly and comfortably in your own rhythm. You can actually feel yourself calming down as you breathe slowly and calmly, and this calm breathing helps you focus and be alert and relaxed. You're learning how to do this so you can apply it under pressure. Continue to breathe slowly and every so often just notice your breathing and focus on allowing your breathing to slow down. Now concentrate on your muscles. You may find that you are holding tension in your muscles. Pay particular attention to your hands, jaw, shoulders. Consciously lower your shoulders, let your shoulders relax and allow the muscles to loosen. This act of relaxing your shoulders allows you to become calm because it places your body in a relaxed, easy position instead of a tense one. Notice your hands and let your hands be open, loose and relaxed. Let your arms rest by your sides, letting go of all tension and just relaxing. Again, now focus on your jaw. Allow your jaw to rest loosely so your teeth are not touching. Let your mouth be loose. Let it be relaxed. Mentally scan your body now, noticing any areas that are tense. When you notice tension, 
concentrate on relaxing that area. Allow your muscles to give up the tension they have been holding. Allow your body to relax. Focus on your breathing again. Just noticing, just relaxing. Count each breath again. Breathing into the count of four. Holding for a count of three. And breathing out to the count of five. Now calm and present, let us focus on impatience. Impatience is a trait that we all experience to varying degrees. Those of us in recovery from our addictions may find that we are particularly susceptible to bouts of impatience, especially with respect to other people. Impatience tends to come on particularly strongly when we are stressed or anxious. It comes out in the form of a decision, a response, or an action before we've had chance to gather enough information to make a rational choice in how we respond, or to seek guidance from a higher power. Urgency is different in that we sometimes need to act fast to seize an opportunity by rapidly gathering information and making the best of what we can with that limited information. Impatience is when we actively block ourselves from new data in a rush to make an irrational decision or other form of response to a situation. This can be painful as this trait is easy to recognise once we've calmed and often there are consequences to this, particularly with regard to our personal relations. Bill sees impatience as reacting faster than a higher power. Before giving that power a chance to slow us down, we react, or even more disastrously, explode and create a whole new host of other problems. When faced with someone who seems to be acting or responding at a slower pace than you would like, Try and zoom out, or levitate above yourself and them. Look down on yourself and the other actors in the situation, as if from the view of a power greater than yourself. You may see yourself red-faced and angry, and see them peaceful and going about their day with other concerns greater than you. You will often find the urgency you perceived is manufactured internally and serves only to harm you. Seeing things from the angle of a higher power can be deeply relaxing. Now, Slowly begin to open your eyes. And free from expectation, take this method of shifting your perspective with you throughout your day. Please keep coming back. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe for more themed daily meditations.